fishing with these uh, in Texas, you're getting at night fishing is the way to go during the summer. Um, um, I've enjoyed it. My trial run, my boat was the first one that had it on it, and I ran it, and nobody else had it. Um, we have amber light on the interior of our boats. Um, the exterior attracts so many bugs, it's ridiculous. Most of our night fishing trips in the past with the old lights were basically fighting mosquitoes. Catch one fish, slap 20 mosquitoes. It's not like that anymore. I have these amber lights on the interior. I'm not getting attacked by bugs. If you had any other light in your boat right now, you'd be getting hammered with bugs. Um, we could flip a white light on in this boat and you'd be immediately attacked by mosquitoes. Um, these little gnats, you will have that. They're nowhere near my face. Um, the lights on the side, those are mosquitoes. Those are bigger bugs, the ones that really bug you during the summertime. Um, these are great for crappie. When summer rolls around, um, the majority of anglers are on the water from 6 o'clock in the morning until 9 o'clock in the morning, and then it's just too ridiculously hot. Uh, we're out here right now. There's not a stitch of wind blowing. I'm sweating. I can only imagine what it was like today, 105 degrees, and sitting out here trying to fish. It just won't happen. You have to night fish in Texas because, for one, the fish are more active. Um, it's cooler. Um, it's a whole lot more fun and more comfortable. Uh, half of my trips on my guided fishing trips are spent during the summertime night fishing. Um, there's a higher success rate for us at night than there is during the day. Mornings we have great success, but then it filters out during the day. And Uh, we like to tie every light we have into a switch. Um, we use inline fuses, so there's no chance of our system tying into any of the factory system and burning anything up. Um, just the flick of a switch, we have the ability to turn off this courtesy light real dark, real fast, um, or the side lights. We can turn off everything at one time with a power light. It's, there's several ways to hook up our lights. Um, we like these two different switches, so you have the option of turning off your amber lights and leaving your green lights on. Um, this basically, this interior lights for tying hooks. You can do this. This is um, just a small LED light. Uh, these I run on my boat for three nights and never recharge my battery. Uh, it's 24 straight hours on a regular standard 12 volt battery. We run these LEDs on a smaller 7 amp deer feeder battery. Um, it's lasted us seven or eight hours. Uh, the intensity goes down, um, but it does last that amount of under time. Under a rub rail, uh, under a splash rail, six inch splash rails, what I have on my guide boat, the lights flash straight down. These, these put out the, the widest bloom. They're straight out. Um, both ways work just fine. Uh, they're set up on 120 degrees. 60 degrees both directions, that way you get plenty of light penetration every direction you need to.